Hi, it's Larry Herb, Xbox Live's Major Nelson here with Mikey Barra, Xbox Quick on Twitter. Mike, you're with the Xbox engineering team and you guys have been pretty busy lately. Yeah, it's been crazy driving up to the release of the new Xbox One experience, listening to fans, iterating as fast as we can. I want to talk about that for a little bit because one of the areas that we've talked about, I've had you on the podcast in the past, is talking about how much faster it is, up to 50% faster. And I thought today we can kind of look at how it's done today and how people will, will do things in the new Xbox One experience, all right? Yeah, sounds great. All right, let's jump into the friends section. How's that? How does that work? Well, if you remember on the existing experience of Xbox One, to get to, to see what your friends are doing, you go right four times from home, go into the friends app, then you can see all your friends. On Xbox One, you just sit left on the thumbstick and you immediately see what your friends are doing. Everything's right there. Everything's right there. So Mike, that's how it works when you're on home, but if I'm playing a game like I'm in Halo 5, playing a little bit of Warzone, how do I invite friends? Yeah, a lot of our, our players, uh, they're in a game, they get an invite, they want to invite people while they're in the game. On the old experience, you have to go out outside of the game, go back to home, go over to friends, launch friends, and then go back to your game. Quite a few steps. Quite a few steps. A lot of fans told us, hey, we want to stay in our game. And so we brought the guide back as mm -hmm. an overlay. So now when you're in a game, tap the Xbox button twice, the guide comes up, and you can see what your friends are doing, join parties and everything. Now, Mike, you mentioned parties. Parties are a huge part of the Xbox Live experience, and your team has done some work there as well. Yeah, you know, fans told us they wanted to make getting into parties a lot easier. And so we added that to the guide. You bring up the guide for pressing left once, go down, and you're in a party. And again, that works in game or out of game. In game or out of game. It's two times faster out of game, three times faster when you're in a game and playing. Now, Mike, what about joining parties? I see, I get notifications sometimes, and in the old system, it, it took a little time, but here, you made it a lot faster. Yeah, we had some feedback about, it's a little bit slow, can you make it faster, and what we did, notification comes up, hit the Xbox button, you're immediately in the party. Now, sometimes I'm in the heat of battle, maybe, again, I'm playing a game of Halo, and I can't really respond to that notification right now, because I'll die. Um, that, how, how do I catch up on that? Yeah, if you miss it, we added notifications to the guide, and we also made it so, so it's grouped. Messages, achievements, and general notifications. So pop up the guide, and then go down to notifications, and you can see everything that you might have missed. And I can clear them out, too. You can clear out, one click. Now, Mike, since Xbox One launched, we have a history of listening to the fans and taking their feedback. The new Xbox One experience is really a culmination of all of that, isn't it? It is. It's a complete new operating system based on Windows 10. Fans told us they wanted faster, easier way to do common tasks. We brought the guide into the product to really drive that. It feels really good. It's been a long ride. The fan feedback has been really positive. And I know your team is far from done. You have a lot of really great plans for next year, right? That's right. Can't share them now, but a lot of great plans. All right, Mike. Thanks so much for watching.